Now let's see the uh, alternate axis of symmetry for methane molecule with an example. Right. So in methane molecule, when I take, let us draw and understand. Suppose I have, I said I'm going to take an example of methane molecule. Right. We will understand what is meant by alternate axis of symmetry. Done. So methane, when I have to represent the structure, one carbon, formula is CH4, done one hydrogen here, one more hydrogen here, the third hydrogen here, one more hydrogen here. Let us number this as one, two, three and four. Done. Right. Now, what are we going to do? We are going to do the rotation by 90 degree. Rotation by 90 degree here we're taking the example of 90 degree when you rotate in this direction right like this how does this look like carbon this plane of this one hydrogen one more hydrogen one more hydrogen one more hydrogen this is first this is second this is third this is fourth because you have rotated like this isn't it done now we said once after rotation you have to do the reflection in a plane perpendicular to that we said correct fine so how does this look? Carbon, rotate like this, reflection on a plane perpendicular to it is it. Now how do you get the hydrogen? This hydrogen one will be here, one more hydrogen here, one more hydrogen here, one more hydrogen here. So this is the fourth one, third one, second one, one. Okay, you're rotating like this, right? And the reflection, the plane, in a plane perpendicular done so this is how is this is what is called as uh, your uh, uh, alternate axis of uh, symmetry students I said a molecule possessing alternate axis of symmetry if one rotated to 360 degree here is it rotation by 90 degree about the axis then followed by the reflection in a plane perpendicular to it so this is a reflection in a plane perpendicular to it. Then this is called alternate axis of symmetry. Right. Thank you for watching students.